CBS 2 exclusive. For weeks, a massive crater on busy Queens Boulevard rattled residents and damaged cars. But was it a pothole or a sinkhole? As New York City struggled to define it, nothing was done. And then we got involved. CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports now from Elmhurst. More than two feet. It looks like a dungeon. A nasty surprise for drivers on Queens Boulevard in front of Queens Center Mall. Tires nailing this deep hole, lucky to escape with rims round and air left. We put a smartphone inside it to get this underground view you never see. It's dangerous. The whole tire could come off. By our measurements, it's about two feet across and more than two feet deep, close to the crosswalk. Well, my foot probably could have got stuck in there. A crossing guard told us this hole opened up in the middle of May. Week after week, it grew. Hopefully, they'll fix it. How fast this gets fixed depends on whether the city declares it a pothole or a sinkhole. A pothole where you can easily see the bottom is the Department of Transportation's responsibility. A sinkhole that goes deeper is left for the Department of Environmental Protection. We called both departments. When a DEP representative arrived, we showed him the trouble spot. DEP workers told me this may not even be their responsibility, but they just wanted to end the public threat. Some reacted by saying it's about time. It shouldn't have to be here that long. Drivers and residents say next time it should be just hours and not weeks to get something like this defined then fixed. In Elmhurst, Queens, Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News.